Hi everyone, this is Janet and I'm here with one of my newest creations. I've done um, um, another mini and the title of the mini is called Cowgirl Chic. And there were a couple things that uh, inspired me to do this album. One is this printed paper here that I used as a border around some of the pages and that is the red and white check and then the hanky handkerchief uh, printed papers. But another thing that inspired me was these pockets. I had seen another crafter online uh, do some things with blue jean pockets and a friend of mine gave me a pair of her daughter's old blue jeans that she didn't fit in anymore and I decided to use the blue jean uh, pockets and materials in this album. So let's get started. I bound uh, the album together with rings that I, I attached some um, um, ribbon to and then I for the first chipboard the front piece I added a piece of light blue uh, printed um, cardstock uh, to the front of this and then as I said earlier I took my uh, heart punch and I punched out hearts in the different printed uh, paper here that I like so well and um, I made the border and then I also mount, uh, matted the title of the album on the red and white checked uh, paper as well. And then I took my first blue jean pocket and I cut it out and I attached it with hot glue to the front of the paper, or to the front of the album. And then at the opening of the album, I hot glued some lace here and then a piece of jute that I, I put up here to sort of represent rope. And then I took two of my Prima flowers, a bright red and a turquoise, and I put them together with um, a white pearl. I stickled it a little bit and put it onto the pocket. And then with my Cricut, I took and I made my little cowgirl here. And she has um, light blue jeans on, and her top is the handkerchief um, print and then her neckerchief is the red and white checked um, paper. So that's the front of my album. Now the page behind, this page here, has the handkerchief printed material on it and you will notice my pages throughout this album are all covered or all edged in lace. And then on this one I made um, a pocket using uh, white cardstock and then I put blue cardstock on top with the light printed blue uh, paper for um, the opening here. And then I made three flowers with a flower punch out of this printed paper and I added a jute bow here. Then down here in the corner I put took two of my paper flowers um, and some light and dark blue stickles uh, and I edged the flowers and then for the center I applied a large red button to be the center of the flower and for the inside I made a little tag it's just a plain white cardstock tag that I put a ribbon across the top with three hearts and then I used um, one of my brads that has little red and pink flowers in it I thought that was really pretty now for the next page I did it. I did this in pink and I figured it's cowgirl and a lot of girls like pink. I edged the paper or the cardstock here with um, the uh, lace and then I took some more of the jute and I put it around to represent the rope. And then uh, the cardstock I used on the chipboard is a light and a dark pink print. I left plenty of room on both pages here. Uh, four pictures and then down here in the corner I took some of my petals and I put them together and on top I put one of my handmade lacy flowers with a seafoam green um, pearl in the center and then I put some um, green leaves in the back. Like I said there's plenty of room on both pages for pictures. On the back of that is another pink page and I used um, I used um, pink cardstock on the chipboard and then I took some of the blue jean material and I made a border all the way around with the blue jean material 
up here in the corner where the ring comes through the page I took a strip of the blue jean material and I made a flower with it by sewing it and then pulling it tight and it made a flower and here I added a little charm and w this is from um, a watch that I bought at the Salvation Army and I, I had my husband take it apart and I'm using the pieces as charms on some of my pages and then down here in the corner I have a beautiful bouquet of dark blue flowers with a couple of um, black eyed Susans some um, baby's breath and I have a little butterfly sitting right there on the flowers in the back I have a piece of lace and then I have some tulle that's white with a little bit of gold on it and then I tied it all together with a jute bow and again there's lace all around and plenty of room for some pictures my next two pages the front and back of this page is um, red it is outlined here with the lace and this is a red printed material it's kind of hard to see the printed material printed pattern I mean but it's there and it's a red printed pattern but over here I took a piece of uh, the blue jean material again and I made a pocket an edge pocket and along the opening I have the lace to match the lace that goes around with a little jute bow and then over here along this edge I took some ribbon and it's red with yellow and pink polka dots up the side there and then I put a three uh, a dimensional butterfly up in the corner there and I also made uh, a tag for that the back is plain and on the front I have ribbon down the side with some um, jute and some red stickles then on the back of that page again it's just the plain um, well the, it's not plain it's a printed material it's very pretty and again it has the lace going around and down here is another one of my blue jean flowers that I made with a teal pearl in the center and a little blue butterfly right there I have some lace uh, that I placed in the back and a piece of jute off to the side with a green uh, leaf plenty of room on both sides for pictures and then over here I took my two favorite printed uh, patterned papers the the checked and the handkerchief um, print and I, I matted them and then I used the handkerchief print to make a pocket here and there's plenty of room here for pictures as well as on the pocket up here in the corner though I took and I made one of the flowers that I learned to make from online and I used the two uh, different prints of paper to make the petals and then I put it together on on white cardstock and I used a little um, red brad with white polka dots on it and then some green leaves behind it I also made um, a tag a red tag using the material from the previous page and then I made some hearts around the top the back is plain and the front is the white and then again on the back I have another little cowgirl here she's in brown shorts and a pink top and um, a little uh, red brad with the white polka dots again again I mounted the two pieces of printed paper that I like with the lace going around and I made another pocket here again I took the pocket and I cut it out and at the top here where the opening is I put lace and this time I put a red bow there then I took some jute and red ribbon and I put it across the pocket and I put some red uh, stickles right here between the two and then around the pocket so this is my cowgirl chic mini album I think any little girl would like to have an album like this I hope you like it I I've been um, totally pleased with this I thank you all for the inspiration um, that I get from um, hearing your comments the encouragement I get 
I thank the crafter that gave me the idea for uh, this uh, pocket here. Um, and I, I hope it inspires you to use some uh, material in some of your albums as well. Thank you for watching. I appreciate any comments that you might have. And I'll see you later. Bye-bye.